Hey everyone, so I thought it'd be fun to make a tag video, um, something kind of random. This isn't really beauty related, but that's okay, because it's fun. Um, I just thought it'd be fun to do like a tag that you just kind of share. <coughs> Sorry, I'm getting over being sick, so if I randomly cough, that's why. Um, I just thought it'd be fun to like share your favorite songs at the moment, because I go through phases, like whatever's going on with my life, like the songs that like kind of get me through that time, like I go through different songs and stuff and I don't know, it's kind of fun because I don't know, music kind of helps um, you like cope with what's going on and just, I don't know, like it just kind of, um, not necessarily word for word, like every, it's not like every song like tells your life story, but like the, the idea of the song or something and I don't know I just think it's super fun how that works and how it makes us feel good when you listen to the song that kind of has to go has to do with what's going on in your life at the moment and so I just thought this would be a fun tag to just kind of say some of the songs that you're kind of listening to all the time like for me I've been listening to some of these songs over and over every single day and it's just kind of like music kind of helps you feel good I don't know so these are the <coughs> sorry these are a couple of the songs that I have been listening to like seriously this month it's just and the artists that I have been listening to over and over are Taylor Swift David Archuleta and sorry getting situated here and Selena Gomez so those are the three artists that I have been listening to. Now I'm going to go ahead and tell you some of the songs. Okay, so I'm going to start out with David Archuleta. And I kind of, um, like a week ago, went back to his album and I was like, holy crap, all these songs are like <gasps> amazing. And they just kind of, I don't know, make me feel good when I listen to them. So the first one that I listened to was A Little Too Not Over You. And I was like, oh snap, I love the song. So you guys can go ahead. And I'll, I'm going to link all the songs that I mentioned in the down bar so you guys can check them out if you want to. So a little too not over you. And I was like, oh snap, I love the song. <laughs> Even though I already loved it. It was just like, you know, like you like rediscover songs and you're like, oh my gosh, I love it. <laughs> so that one. And then I discovered a new one and I was like, oh, like it's. It literally kind of made, it made me tear up. Like I teared up when I heard it and I was like, wow. And I've been listening to it every day. I, I probably listened to it like three times already today, which isn't that much because it's five o'clock, but um, it's called To Be With You. And like, <laughs> it's an amazing song. You guys, it's really beautiful too. Um, that one, um, your Eyes Don't Lie by David Archuleta. These are all on his like self-titled album. Um, My Hands by David Archuleta is also another one. So those are kind of the main ones that are like, well, I love them. They're amazing. And then Taylor Swift was more of the beginning of the month that I was obsessed. Why well, I get I go through Taylor Swift phases. Um, I love her all the time but like there's phases that I'm just like listening to her songs 24 7 and this month I did and it was pretty much her whole Speak Now album <coughs> but the main songs were Sparks Fly okay no, no I'm sorry let's go in order of importance the first song was Enchanted um that was like a big song like this month I was just like mm, okay because like I was I had a phase back in December and Enchanted was like my theme song and now it like came back around. So that one, Sparks Fly, uh, Back to December is a good one. Um, Haunted is a good one and Last Kiss uh, are some of the ones that I kind of listen to like nonstop. And then also from her Fearless album, Fearless, um, and then from her self-titled Stay Beautiful and our song so those were kind of the ones from Taylor that I was obsessed with and then now Selena Gomez I've been listening like I seriously 
listened to, holy crap, okay, I'm looking at the um, numbers of plays, and these are all from like the past week <coughs> that I've been listening to these songs. The first, the most played one is Middle of Nowhere, um, that I've been playing over and over again. 20 plays. Um, I think one day I played it like, I don't know, 10 times in a row. And then My Dilemma, which is a newer one that I got the other day, and it only has 10 plays. And then Love You Like a Love Song, which is Bomb Diggity, has only 11 plays, but Middle of Nowhere is one that I've just played over and over. And then A Year Without Rain definitely was one of them. Um, so those were kind of the Selena ones. Especially Middle of Nowhere and My Dilemma and Love You Like a Love Song. Those three ones from When the Sun Goes Down. I believe that's what it's called. It's either When the Sun Goes Down or When the Sun Goes Up. And I'm pretty sure it's when, yep, it's when the sun goes down. Um, so yeah, those are the songs that I've just been like listening to this whole week over and over and over again. And they're just really amazing. So um, if you guys would like to do this tag, feel free. Because it's pretty fun. Um, how music works that way when you just have, go through these phases and these songs that you've listened to over and over. So um, if you guys want, you can tell me what songs you've been listening to lately in a video or a comment, whatever you guys want. So yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys!